Glory to God. Hallelujah. This is Prayers and Counseling with Damaris. If you're seeing me for your very first time, you're welcome. I love you so much. The Lord bless you mightily in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let us pray. Father, we thank you for your awesome word. We give you glory. Thank you, Lord, for always sending your word when we need to hear it most. We love you, our Father, but we thank you for your love that surpasses us. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. God says, you should call this person immediately. God says, you should call this person immediately. You are in this relationship and for some reason, your partner hurts you so badly. And you are so angry, so devastated. And then you said, you know what? It's over between us. But this person feels so ashamed and is really, really remorseful. Now, this is the reason why God wants you to call this person. It's because this person knows how angry you are and how unapproachable you are and that is why they are afraid now you might lose good people in your life because of anger because you are so vexed and then you decide to close the doors whereas this person is someone that god put in your path for a certain reason but because you are so hurt you let your emotions take the better part of you god says Call this person and you talk about it. You're going to realize so many things. And this is because in your mind, you think they are better out there. But really, there isn't any better. Because there's someone that God has put in your path who is just meant for you. Who is your perfect fit? And if you lose them, you're going to struggle in the life of others. God says, call this person so you talk things over. I pray that God is going to give you a heart of forgiveness, a very soft heart, a heart easy to, as easy as it can love, so easy it can forgive. Because you are someone who is easy to make decisions. You make decisions and you stand by it. You are so firm with it. Honey, it is not good. Sometimes just let things go. Sometimes forgive. Sometimes be easy. The Bible says, forgive us our trespasses. It didn't end there as we forgive those who trespass against us. Now, it means that the mode of forgiveness is if you forgive. I pray that the Lord bless you. I pray that the Lord keep you. I pray that he causes his face to shine upon you. I pray that he gives you peace. The peace that is beyond human understanding. In the name of Jesus, amen. The shalom of the Lord. Nothing missing, nothing broken. I love you, child of God, but Jesus loves you and I even more. And that is what matters. Amen.